Alex had known that I had had a show. So he asked me if I had had belts in the show and I told him and he asked me to bring them over. I showed him which ones and he, uh, he picked one and he liked it and he came up with the idea to have the Anarchy Championship. And I was excited with that because I was going to get to, you know, along with introducing a new character, new heel, being the biggest asshole I could be, I got to bring in a new championship to the show and introduce a brand new element to the show, add something new. And that was just going to be, you know, groundbreaking for the show because it's just a whole new part of the show. It's not just focused on one championship. Now there's going to be two top guys. There's going to be two champions. It opened up a lot of opportunity for anyone to become a champion. I really wanted the, the Anarchy Championship to be a secondary title, you know, and have it be meaningful. The Anarchy Championship is main evented shows sometimes. But I knew that with another championship in ESW, it can make some of the wrestlers happy to hold something, you know. Um, with a roster of 15, 16 wrestlers and one championship, it's hard to, you know, make everybody happy. It was always, it was always fun to hold it because it, it's the secondary title, but at the same time, it wasn't as serious as the uh, ESW championship, and we could have fun with it. I put in the Anarchy Championship that it was going to be defended 24-7. As long as there's a referee, the champion is defending the title. That title was be was able to be defended anywhere at any time. Uh, the fact that it's 24-7, anything, anything goes, basically. You could lose at any time. It meant a lot for the fact that, hey, dude, you were the wrestler that you had to watch your back, basically 24-7. As you're in an Anarchy Anarchy Championship match and the people started running in. It was just, it was awesome. Like, you know, like, you never know who's gonna come out. You never even know if someone is gonna come out. And they come out, they win it real quick, and then they lose it. Like, you know, it's just awesome, but you know, like, you, you were champion. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it was really good. Hey, guys! Hey, yeah, we're gonna start in about five minutes. Just give us a little time, okay? Come on, come on. Let's show One, two, three. Osiris decided that it was time to take ESW outside the backyard. And what did we do? We went out to the city park of Somerset and wrestled in the city park. And we started here in the backyard for about like five minutes, went out a little bit here, did some cool things, and then we went straight to the, to the park. Fucking anarchy champion. I'm gonna fucking PL3 says, but Alex G is out of his own fucking show. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. stickers in us a lot and uh, you can actually see me in uh, one of the clips where I look at my hand I look at his head and I just pow, put it right in his head so he'd get off me and then uh, we, we had to stop right then and take all the stickers out of us uh, to this day he still calls me a dickhead for that Just funny moments, you know. And then we did the Anarchy Warfares, where we were out in fields, and the title changed hands a bunch of times. Someone, uh, real quick, finisher, and boom, one, two, three, new Anarchy Champion. Someone will come in to finish a one, two, three, Anarchy Champion. Someone else come in, finish your one, two, three, Anarchy Champion. It just went on and on until it just ended. We just did that because we were bored, you know. We, we didn't have a show that weekend. Well, hey, let's go out and film an Anarchy Warfare. And because of the Anarchy Championship, we could do that. One, two, three! Yes! Your new Anarchy Champion! Whoa! Big Show Rob! Uh. One, two, three! Yeah, baby! Your new uh, Undisputed Champion! 
That's right, motherfucker, undisputed. Second time. Go. Oh, oh. it. One, two, three. You knew. I'm the champion, Austin G. Now we can we can do stuff like that to where our title is versatile. It's not just a one-on-one -on -one match way to get it, or you have to be in a certain stipulation to get it because anyone can win it. And that was kind of an exciting thing because we could be like how WWE had the hardcore title to where anyone could run out, like anyone can run out and win it. Why should I say that I am a two-time Anarchy Champion? Why should I have to tell everybody that I won't ever get fired again? Oh, shit! Oh. 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 Oh.